So on to the maiden races now then. And the Stu Gray maiden for three-year-olds over a mile is the first one of them on the straight track at Ascot. So there shouldn't be any problems. The fields are not that too big this year anyway. And at the top we've got Adagel Caesar for Graham Clutterbuck. And Elko McBay for CDJ Liggett. Endangered Beast for Dan Hughes. Fear the Man Michael Scala. Gold Touchley on Van Rensburg. High Standing Neil Mac Marino. Demand David Robertson. Maximus Wildman. Paul Rhodes. Robin of Loxley. Daniel French. Rock Steady Martin. Linham Stone Pitts. Darren Thompson. And the Black Prince, Joshua Sutherland, Touraine, James Shea, and Woodwind for Padre Hogan. So 14 of the men put the straight at Ascot away and racing. And closest to us and slowly away was Rock Steady. Also a little bit slow out was high standing, but right up the centre of the track, Maximus Wildman in the red jacket trying to get over this near side fence is just about the leader with the grey stone pits on his inside. Then endangered beast right over on the far side, another Grand Marino Demand is being chased by Terrain, and also over on that far side we've got Robin of Loxley, and the final of the greys is Fear the Man, but it's Maximus Wildman who's down on this near side fence who's got the lead by about two lengths to the blue jacketed endangered beast, the grey six stone pit. Is, is next alongside that one is Woodwind right over on the far side Marino Demand leaves that little group racing on its own in, in between the two groups is the Black Prince and the Black and Red Hoops with Joshua Southern trying to make his way through the field now he's Gold Touch also Rocksteady's trying to run on as well but it's Maximus Wildman who leads Maximus Wildman is four lengths clear of Marino Demand who's going really well on the upper centre of the track and also coming through Robin of Loxley and Turain those three going well together Maximus Wildman's clear on this near side got nothing to race with trying to come through still his gold touch stone pits is trying to run on again so too is rock steady but it's Maximus Wildman who's still too clear off terrain over on the far side gold touch is now coming through into second Robin of Locks is there Marino Demand trying to stick on but it's Maximus Wildman for long to go and Maximus Wildman's just about in front still by two lengths two gold touch in second terrain is now trying to fight through and also coming through Robin Locks the Black Prince is coming through as well and now terrain and a gold touch his gold touch on his near side terrain up the centre of the track gold touch just in front Terrain trying to close, they flat bust the post together. Gold touch and terrain, it's close. They're separated by half the track. Could be a quick fire double for Leon van Rensburg, or it could be the first winner of the season for Daniel French. It looks like it's Leon that's got it. It's a win for Gold Touch for Leon Van Rensburg. Terrain for James Shea was second. Stone Pitts for Darren Thompson was third. The Black Prince, Joshua Sutherland, was fourth. An endangered beast for Dan Hughes was fifth.